Welcome to Real Estate Investment Management Brokerage Development, hanging sheetrock and getting two seams and a stud to fit together. So we have this, we have this piece of sheetrock here that's going to have to stretch from here to here. And it's going to have to end halfway on this stud and halfway on this stud. So the stud is one, one and three quarters. Um, so, I'm sorry, it's one and a half. And so three quarters of an inch on each side is, is where you need to pull the sheetrock. Now, how do you measure and cut exactly from one side to another so your sheetrock falls exactly there? And the answer is you don't. You do this trick. So we added a stud like this um, the long way. So instead of having just one and a half inches to work with, we have three and a half inches to work with. So this is one and three quarter inch sticking out here, and I need to meet it at three quarter inch here. So see how this is a manufactured edge here? It's cut by the company. We want the manufactured edge on this side because we know it's going to be straight. And the side we cut, which isn't going to be perfect, will go on this side so it has more room. Now we've measured the gap, the space from here to here. At the bottom, it was one in, or 28 and three quarters. In the middle, it was 28 and a half. In the top, was 28 and a fourth. So what you want to do is you want to cut to the shortest width um, because if it's too big it just won't fit in the cavity in the space. So we took three measurements and then we cut the smallest measurement and this measurement here is 28 and a fourth and the 28 and a fourth is going to fit in here and see how this cut edge that's not exactly straight. It looks straight, but it's not exactly straight. We know this manufactured edge is straight as can be, right? So we're going to put the manufactured edge here, um, and we know it will be perfect. And then the edge we cut, we're going to put over here, and we'll have some, some extra room. Um, so we hope this helps you... Uh, learn how to cut and measure and fit sheetrock into difficult spaces when you're uh, dividing a stud, putting the seam of a sheetrock on both uh, sides of a one and a half inch stud. We hope you use the manufactured edge on each side here. Hope that helps you.